Venezuela's president is looking to secure another six years in power in Sunday's election. And at his final rally, he got the support of Argentina's football legend Diego Maradona. The economy is in deep crisis, but since the two most popular opposition leaders are banned from running, Nicolas Maduro is expected to win. They are taking away from me the power to act against the criminal mafia of the economy and to do all that I want to do with the power that you have to give to me. I ask you to give me the power. Thousands of Venezuelans have already voted with their feet. They fled to soaring inflation, shortages of food and medicine and are trying to eke out a living in neighbouring Colombia and Brazil. Henry Falcon is the man Maduro has to beat and he's in fighting mood. At his final rally he waved a copy of a hundred dollar bill to remind voters that he ditched the national currency the Bolivar and dollarized the economy. We're not going to sit with our arms folded because we have to go out and defend Venezuela and I, here and now, say to Nicolas Maduro that the people want you to go to hell, Maduro, because you've done a lot of damage to Venezuela. Whoever wins on Sunday has a lot of work to do. The International Monetary Fund says the inflation rate is an eye-watering 13,000 percent and with the healthcare system in crisis, the World Health Organization warns that malaria is spreading rapidly.